Cartoon Cartoons. myself. My name is Eater and welcome back to our Space Week 2024 when everything is so possible. So today we are going to take a look at the supercut of Annoying Orange in Space. Just kidding. Outer space is fun. My my assistant Sandy will help you. So glad to meet you. How's it working now? So uh, we're going to today we're going to get started on this time. So uh, are you ready Sandy? Uh, sure I am. Here we go. Wow, look at that sky. It is beautiful. Hey, check it out, Orange. There's Cassiopeia. Hey, was... hey, Onion. What? No, no. It's well, he can watch it all over and over and over again. Dude, that's not an onion. Wow, Onion's the biggest star that I've ever seen. Dude, it's not an onion. It's... What the? Whoa! What's that one called? Oh! Wait a second, Orange. That's Blizzard Blastoids! What's going on in a space line, actually? Still living on the moon or somewhere? Oh my god! Close encounters of the annoying kind! Whoa! What the? <clears throat> are we? No, definitely broccoli time. That? It's broccoli. Welcome to space, Earthlings. Space? Hey, hey, broccoli. Why is still in an outer space this healthy. time? <laughs> no need to chat about that. The beaver? Is Justin Bieber here? Yay! What? No, I said later. Take me to your beaver. <laughs> <laughs> All right, minions. Show me the money! What do you have for me? Hey, you must be the beaver. Sing, baby. Sing it. Do it now. Hold on there a second, my little. Still like in my own time. I've got the beaver fever. There's no worry <laughs> about this time. You know, Orange, you're acting glib right now. Hey, sorry about that. Uh, Orange gets a little excited sometimes. I, I think what he's trying to ask is, why are we here? Why are you here? You want the truth? Yeah. You can't handle the truth. The truth of the matter is. Still living on the moon this time. <laughs> this is gone to seriously control. And why is your broccoli with sunglasses? Silence! Bring in the Vivisector 9000! Whoa, it's a giant bedazzler! No, it's not a bedazzler. Ooh, bedazzle my jacket! Bedazzle my jacket! What the? It needs more rhinestones. <laughs> No, Still a little this bit dummy. Is for dissecting. You see, Orange, we are traveling across the universe, studying the most intelligent life forms we can find. Um, I think you might have the wrong guy. Yeah, Pear's not the brightest guy in the world. Uh, silence! It's time to see what you two are really made of. Here is Sector 9000. Target the Very strange looking thing, thing my own time. <laughs> hey, Pear, look what I can do. It's all definitely quadsy. Whoa! Oh. I didn't know the ship had cruise control. <laughs> well, she's dead. Still living alone. No more. No more. Love live. I'm new leader. Yay! Yay! I'm the new beaver. What 
Look at your first command, new leader. Ooh, I know what we can do. Oh boy, here we go. Yay! Now I'm a big star too. <laughs> Dude, that's not a star. Shut up, pear. Annoying orange in time to burn. So ready to heat up some privacy on my own. Still definitely hot. Still heat and danger this time. Still definitely hot in here. Uh, is everyone? Is everyone okay? <laughs> Still burned up. Really, he's blinking the ground this time. Oh no, it's happening again. All right, people, battle station. I need you to be professional. No sweat, Boba Fett. What? What, what now? I said no sweat, Boba Fett. Um, is that a new catchphrase? Um, maybe. Whatever happened to Burrito Burrito? That was aces. Totally over hmm. it. Still don't like it. You really like it. No flying around in space this time. All right, let's get this catastrophe up on the big screen. I like in space this time. Dude, that's the wrong catastrophe. Wait for it. Wait for it. No, definitely attack. What the what? Is he in space? It gets worse. The radar's picking up a you at Definitely wrecked. Something might be a super speed this time. Don't definitely bar. Don't definitely reverse. Ooh, very explosive. wants to party in your mouth ew gross but but where's orange beats me still gone since forever <laughs> still living on time machine though that sound burns it is i alien orange uh, you're an alien huh explains a lot uh, Thoroughly enjoyed your earthling humor. Ha. Well, well, alien orange. Still laughing at this. These earthlings wanted to go to space. Oh, this question is so fantastic. It has my antenna all busted. Ah, ah, Still losing this it. time. Goodness. Now, here are a couple ways to get. Ooh, that's easy as in any way. Become an astronaut. And to do that, better practice your moonwalk. <laughs> no, no, not that kind of moonwalk, dude. This kind of moonwalk. Still yeah. moonwalk for the dance. The I can't even wait to see this. Here's option two for getting to space. Get really, really rich. That's right. Once your stacks of money are tall enough, you can simply climb them to outer space. <laughs> no, no, that's not what I mean, Orange. There are Ooh, still like it. Space a rocket. That's really <laughs> exists. But there, you're forgetting a third option. I am? Y'all better get option out three. time. Um, do you even know how to do that? Oh, yeah. How are you going to get back down to Earth 
safely. Oh, boy. Well, I really didn't think this through, did I? You think? Man, if I'd written this to space, you'd be reading my orbituary. <laughs> Hardy, har, har, har. Now, I don't want to let this rocket go to waste. Good luck, Snake Eyes. This ride should be a real three, two, one, blast. <laughs> so, quick question. You just sent a toy up Ooh. on a huge rocket. Correct. Didn't really get the toy huge one my own. The rocket in any way. Correct. So oh, definitely in space, huh? I don't know. Right back towards Earth at any moment. I hadn't considered that, but yeah, I'd say that's a correct look at it. That's hey, very explosive. And this is the Juice, the prettiest talk show in the entire galaxy. Ooh. Nice. I don't know about you guys, but I'm juiced for today's episode. What do we got on tap, pair? It's a question that's truly out of this world, Ooh, Orange. Still like you it. had to bring three things into space, what would you bring? I knew it was just a matter of space time before someone floated a question like that. <laughs> Get ready for a tall glass of answers, fruit lovers, because I want to know what's the Would you take to space, Marshy? And who would you leave behind? You have to pick. Still definitely if close. If Marshmallow stepped us into bags, there'd be nothing protecting us from the elements. We'd probably all just die. No, 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 no. Marshy is trying to kill us? I knew it. I really wish I had Okay, that's enough. Let's stop teasing Marshy and get real mm. for a second. I bet I can do space, this. The three things I'm bringing are food, water, and oxygen. Simple as that. Still like ah! it. Still intelligent. Why are you booing me? It's a good answer. <laughs> it's a boring answer. <laughs> well, I'm sorry you find my pragmatism boring. Sounds good a while now. If it's me going to space, I'm bringing Sudoku. Sudoku? The logic based combinatorial number placement puzzle? You betcha. I mean, it's bound to get boring in space, right? So I bring Sudoku to keep myself entertained. I mean, that's a pretty terrible pick. But at least you have two other chances to make it right. Great point, Pear. Second thing I'd bring, a pen. You know, to play Sudoku with. Smart! Is it? Smart thinking, huh? You know, the like it. Even now, no matter what. Let me get this straight. So instead of bringing three things to your journey through space, you're now just bringing one completely frivolous thing. Hey, it's a short list, but that's how he rolls. <laughs> What's Sudoku? I want to learn how to play. <laughs> what is happening? Okay, okay, everyone. Allow me to get things back on track. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> First thing I'd bring to space. A can of beans! That's a surprisingly good choice, Orange. I agree. It's important to have food. Oh, I'm not bringing it for food. I'm bringing it for propulsion. Do I like it. do a number on me, so I know that with enough beans, I'll be able to blast myself in any direction I please. <laughs> Still got space gas. Uh, item number two, of course, is soda. I definitely bring soda to space. Let me guess. It's not because you'll get thirsty. Silly pear. It's because I'll get going too fast because of the beans. This way, I can burp myself to a stop. See? This is insane. Although it exhibits a weirdly keen understanding. It's still of definitely dumb, huh? And finally, I bring a stone chisel plaque commemorating what happened here today. Because we can never, ever forget that Marshmallow tried to kill us all. I didn't mean to, friends. I'm sorry. Nah, we're just kidding, Marshy. Oh, I love jokes. <laughs> so what's the third thing you actually bring, Orange? Definitely Sudoku. Now oh, come on. <laughs> So anyways, we'll see you tomorrow.
Bye guys. Thanks for watching.